Hello students, till now we have done question number 6. Today we will start from question number 7 to 9 given on page number 5 of your mathematics book. Now have a look on board. Question number 7 is write in expanded form. So we will solve part B. Statement is 1280. So we will take currency notes. 1280. So there is no digit at one's place. We will not take any one rupee note. Now we will take mark cards. So it shows 1280. Now if we will open this man card, we will find the expanded form of the given number. So let's open it. 1280. So the expanded form of the number is hidden in the man card only. So if we combine it again, we will get the same figure. So we get 1280, 1280. So in your answer you will write it as 1000 plus 200 plus 80. To solve this question in your notebooks, write the question, part you are answering and the solution. Next question number 8. Form the greatest and smallest numbers by using the following numbers. So here we will solve part B. Statement is 1, 2, 3, 4. So first of all we will solve greatest number. So to make the greatest number we have to find which one among these is the greatest digit. So it is 4. Then smaller than 4 is 3. Next 2. And at last 1. So the number formulated is 4321. And next to form the smallest number we will find the smallest digit among these. So the smallest digit is 1. Then greater than 1 is 2. Next 3. And at last 4. So this number formulated is 1234. So it is clear that to form the greatest number we will find the greatest number among these to be the first one. And to formulate the smallest number we will find which one is the smallest to start the number. So to answer the question in your notebooks, write the question, then the part you are answering. On one side write greatest number, on the other smallest number and write the number formulate. Next question number 9. Follow the pattern and fill in the blanks. We will solve B part of this question. So the statement is 2018. 2019, 2020, 2021. Now we will see that here it is 2018. So next comes 2019 which means we have same notes of 1000 and 10 and only 1 rupee note is increasing that is by 1. So next if we add one more 1 rupee note here becomes 2020. Then add one more 1 rupee note 2021. So next statement will be 2000. And if we add 1 rupee note more than 2022. Next will be 2023. So if we add one more rupee note then it will become 2000. 24. So by adding one more 1 rupee note it becomes 2025. Question in your notebooks. 
write the question part you are answering and fill in the blanks now one one part of each question i have solved for you and the remaining parts you will solve by yourself thank you